Today, we're going to be talking about bipods. How's it going folks? Today we are going to be doing a review on a couple of bipods from Mighty Tactical. So we got before me the Triplex bipod and we have the Swift Stance bipod. So we're going to start off by talking about the Swift Stance just because it has a little more uh, bells and whistles to it. Now this bipod is a little heavier than the triplex, however with that being said it's not a huge deal because it got some pretty neat features. So right off the bat it has a quick attachment mount right here as you can see there's a lever. You can obviously put this on and off your mount really fast and easy, mount it to your rifle, dismount it, whatever you got to do takes two seconds. Now on the bottom on the back side you'll see that there's this wheel right here. Now what this wheel does is it adjusts the spring that's inside the actual bipod. So what this spring does is it allows you to pan and tilt your rifle or crossbow in a given direction. So you obviously have rotation 360 degrees. If something's walking you can rotate your rifle uh, accordingly without having to pick it up and move it. And it also has a little bit of a tilt. So let's say you're on uneven ground You've done everything you can by adjusting the legs and you just need a little more tilt to the left or right and that's what this tilt does. It gives you that tilt, that option to the left or right. Now on the side I got these half gear looking things and these are adjustments for the legs. These legs have five settings, stowed back, 75 back, 90 degrees down, 75 forward and stowed forward like this. Simply just press on this little button and make those adjustments. Its length when it's contracted like this is six and a half inches and fully adjusted, nine and a half inches. To make the legs longer, you pull down on this little sleeve, pull down just like that, and you have a nine and a half inch bipod. Now, there are grooves in it so that you can adjust the bipod according to your height or to the height that you need it. Also, they can be adjusted separately so you're not dealing with a fixed height. This is super nice when you're on uneven terrain and you got a post up on one side and maybe have a longer leg. Maybe you're up against a little rock, cliff, a ledge, whatever it is, you have that ability and flexibility um, to take the perfect shot. But other than that, it's pretty simple little bipod. I actually have it on my uh, mega back crossbar right here and I wanna show you guys what I mean about the panning. So you can see my bipod is straightforward. Let's say there's a deer walking, I can pan with it without having to move the actual crossbow. Now if I was on an angle, I can tilt it one way or the other to get a nice end level shot. So that's the bipod I have on my crossbow just because of that flexibility uh, to take the shot that you need. Next up, we have the triplex bipod. Now this is gonna be a lighter, lighter bipod. Uh, however, it has a little less bells and whistles to it. So it does have this Picatinny mount that you can attach to a Picatinny rail, um, but it also comes with a rifle barrel mount. And you put this on your barrel and you can attach this bipod to your barrel. And this is gonna be more of a keep it on there for good type of deals. Uh, it only has two options, straight down or straight back just like this. As far as height, it is six and a half inches tall. And the legs do have a little bit of play in them. If you twist this little uh, grip thing right here to the left, you can see there's a little spring legs uh, that jump out and you have just a little bit more ability to adjust per terrain. However, not as much as the Swift does. However, just a little bit for those that need it. And that's pretty much it. Super simple little bipod, throw it on your rifle, keep it on there. If you ever need to use it, you got it. It's pretty lightweight. And that's a wrap for these bipods. Now I know this is a quick little uh, review overview video. However, there's not much to bipods. They're pretty self-explanatory. Throw it on, get more stability, take better shots. Uh, key differences is that the triplex is just a simpler bipod and the Swift has more bills and whistles to it and that's up to you to decide which one you prefer. With that being said, if you guys want more information on either one of these bipods, check out Mighty 
tactical.com and you'll be directed to this site or check the link down below. Thank you guys so much and I'll see you next time.